I am Anil Kumar and we are trying to understand how to find volume of a rectangular prism. The question here is, which colored face would you use for the base if you wanted to calculate volume of each prism and why? So we have two different prisms here, both are rectangular prisms. We need to find the volume of these two prisms. And you know, what is volume? So volume is area of base. times height that is volume right so normally you know multiplication is commutative so you can multiply in any particular order but if you want to identify a base which dimension in the given figures should we take as the base that is kind of the question which we're trying to understand now since area of the base has to be calculated uh, in the first figure we have 4 5 and 5.3 so we'll go with the round numbers, right? So these are whole numbers, 4 and 5. Do you see that? 4 and 5. And that's a decimal number. It is kind of difficult to multiply by decimal number. So we'll take 4 times 5 as our base. So the base for us will be 4 times 5. So that will be the base for us. And then we'll multiply by height, which is 5.3. And of course, the units will be centimeter cube. So in this kind of question, what we're trying to say is that whenever you have a choice, select the base which has uh, numbers easy to multiply. So 4 times 5 is a number easy to multiply. We'll take that as our base. Okay, so that is what it is. In the second figure, we have 4, 8.1 as the length and then height of 4. So in this case, if you are given a choice then area of base we could take as as 4 times 4 right think this 4 is 4 here correct so 4 times 4 could be a good option so area of base in this case would be 4 times 4 right since they are whole numbers and once you calculate this which is equals to 16 we could multiply 16 by height I mean in this case the length uh, 8.1 to get the volume right so that's the whole idea so that is what you can do so you can have 20 times 5.3 so it becomes easier do you see that now 0 will make it 53 multiply by 2 so 2 times 3 is 6 2 times 5 is 10 so 106 centimeter cube is your answer right so that is how it becomes kind of simpler to multiply and get your answer right so in this case let us do our multiplication or you could do with calculator also 16 times 8.1 and you can write your answer as equal to 129.6 right so so that is how you could do it but the idea is in case you have a choice then base should be selected with whole numbers that is the case right so uh, remember that part i hope that helps thank you and all the best so let me write down the units also always write down units volume is always in cube area will be in centimeter square correct so 16 centimeter square times 8.1 centimeters will give you a volume of 129.6 centimeter cube thank you